estamos en la época. Hombre, dictas y resistem. Vă rugăm frumos, intrați pe Google și citiți ce s-a întâmplat la 16 mai despre existența Romilor. Cred că Romii mai rezistă. Da, da, da. Acum am intrat de la RSL. Existența Romilor. Existența! Ora! Tonight, we remember the act of bravery of 3,000 men who decided to stand against Nazi soldiers sent to kill them. Despite having no weapons, they mustered the courage needed to save their families. That day, their sense of determination equaled the power of machine guns. 77 years later, there are many who still fight different fights. Tonight, we commemorate 16th of May 1944 when groups of Roma fought the Nazi soldiers sent to kill them, but we also celebrate those who resist in different ways. Those who face evictions, those who face diseases, financial difficulties, poverty, as well as social exclusion. Tonight, we will use the purifying power of fire to erase all of the evil against all people. Opre Roma! On June 7th, journalists from the ICTV channel arrived to a Rome camp in Kyiv. They came with another right-wing radical group, National Drużyna, claiming that this was a security measure. The visit was broadcast on Facebook by the first deputy chairman of the National Corps, Nazari Kravchenko. The police arrived at the camp shortly after the ultra-right radicals, but it turned out they weren't very keen on the Roma presence either. One could say that they also do a lot of harm, small crimes. But we can't really kick them out. Why do you think we'd want them to live here? Everyone should live where they have a house and residence permit. With the influx of journalists, police and radicals, the Roma decided to abandon the forest. 
To make sure the Roma community had nowhere to return to, the National Drujina members decided to destroy their homes, claiming to be clearing the forest. The attack was broadcast on their official Facebook page. The inhabitants who started gathering around the time of the attack were harassed and even beaten. The police just calmly watched the whole thing. We are here to maintain public order. They want to uh, throw on us all the responsibility, but it was a cooperation of the police and the uh, official authorities of the, this district. It was also very great manipulation when Ukrainian uh, TV show, oh, just look, this stand uh, burned uh, siege activist, but it was burned by their own uh, Roma people. The C-14 attack inspired other attacks across the country. Like this one by National Corps, which they streamed live on the internet. Six hundred people put this kind of like. Yeah.